Hey, hello everyone. I hope you are all having a wonderful day. Abu Lakai hauling at you again here on YouTube, bringing you another gear that we have from Black Hawk. But before we go on, I wanted to say thank you to all our subscribers and for those who just happened to click the thumbnail. Thank you for watching and visiting my channel. At siyempre, di po natin makakalimutan ang ating mga kababayang mga Pilipino. Magandang araw po sa inyong lahat. I own several handguns and I am one of those individuals who gets frustrated of changing holsters every time I go to the range. Multiple holsters for multiple handguns is no longer an issue. It looks like Black Hawk recognized the buffling circumstances that many gun owners were dealing with. That's why they came up with a holster that can accommodate at least 150 semi-automatic handgun style. Today, we are going to take a close look at the Black Hawk Hunger Multifit Holster. With that said, let's go to the table and take a look at this range shooting gear. Okay, my friends, before we continue, I just wanted to say that this video is about a firearm holster and I am not selling this product and no modifications has been made with the firearm that we are about to use in this video. We are on the table again to check out a shooting gear that we bought online. This is the Omnivore holster made by Blockhawk. The uh, company makes good uh, quality products and in my humble experience and opinion, I've tested some of their gear during my active duty years in the military when I got deployed overseas fighting the war on terrorism. And I would say that Black Hawk gear do last long. <clears throat> Looks pretty good, huh? Now, we are going to open this, uh, this product and uh, see what we have inside. All right, everybody, here are the components that comes in the box when you buy this holster. Of course, we have the Omnivore holster itself. I will put it over here. All right, it comes with a uh, paddle mount as well. Put it right here. And also, we have a uh, belt loop mount. Pretty sturdy. <clears throat> and with all the attachment that comes with it. I'll put it over here. I will lay all the uh, components on the table so you know what we have in a box. And also, it comes with a uh, two thumb pads. Give you an idea what it looks like. Right over here. Alright, and a uh, set of screws. And of course, the one that makes it all happen is that it comes with two rail attachment devices. I'll put it over here and uh, we also have the instruction manual read the instruction manual everyone because this one right here will give you all the information you needed to put this uh, holster together and also Blackhawk included a sticker right over here I'll put it over here all right all right everyone this are all the components that comes in the box when you buy this product this holster comes with two types of attachment it comes with a fixed belt loop that can solidly secure to a one and three quarter inch belt with uh, locking belt tabs or if you want to keep it simple black hawk also included a uh, paddle kit right here i like the uh, paddle kit for a quick grab and go but the belt loop is better because the two belt loops right here, the two belt loop attachment with the extra tabs will securely hold the holster in place. I would say though that uh, both attachments are great because when you finally attach the holster, it can be adjusted based on the shooter's preference. It can be attached as 
straight up draw like such or you can also angle the holster like this all right canted holster have its own advantage and disadvantages and it depends on the shooter's preference here is a uh, let me pick it up okay here is the close look of the uh, holster to give you an idea of what it looks like the material is made out of hardened plastic uh, rubberized clothing covers some parts of the holster to protect it from impacts and also to uh, reduce uh, scratches and uh, noise when bumping into uh, things uh, right here is the thumb release and all you have to do is press this down to uh, draw the firearm and of course not all of us have the same size of hands so for shooters who have longer or short fingers black hawk included an extra thumb pads or spacers so you can adjust the release height to where you want it to be in order to obtain that perfect draw when you push uh, this release with your thumb it disengages the uh, lacking uh, mechanism inside when drawing the handgun and you know it's it is very very simple to use very easy to use the omnivore holster comes with three different models they have the surefire x300 the uh, streamlight dlr1 and 2 and the non-light bearing i choose the uh, non-light bearing because it looks like the other two model is specific for handgun that has those two types of flashlight attached uh, on the rails. Oh, what made the what made it possible to accommodate multiple handgun is because the active retention mechanism that you see inside inside right here locks onto uh, the specified weapon light, such as the Surefire and uh, Streamlight, or onto the rail attach. Uh, onto the rail attachment devices that they added that comes with the uh, the uh, non light uh, the non bearing light model which is the one that we have right now so if you don't have a surefire 300 or TLR flashlight make sure that you get the non light bearing model like the one we have right now if you get the light bearing model and you don't have this the, the specified flashlight your handgun will not fit into the holster all right let's go ahead and uh, put the uh, put the rail attachment device onto the pistol and of course unfortunately I am not going to show you how to attach the rail attachment device onto the rail because YouTube has a new policy and they uh, i'm seeing a lot of youtubers that are being you know uh, getting strikes and sometimes their videos are deleted all right so i'll be back i'll be back i will attach this uh, attachment devices on the pistol and uh, i'll be back in a moment all right everybody here we are with the rail attachment device installed onto the handgun and I attach it onto the uh, Springfield XD. And by the way, Black Hawk included two attachment devices in the package. And I also wanted to say that I already, I already uh, cleared the firearm. And I assure you that this firearm is uh, rendered as a safe gun at the moment. Now, let us holster the firearm and see if it fits. Wow, look at that. Not bad, I guess. Yeah, not bad. Look at that. All right. Now, if your farm is a little loose, well, if your farm is a little loose, what you can do is tighten the uh, retention screw that is located at the backside of the holster and it will get snagged there really good. All right. See that? Wow, pretty good, huh? Well, I still have my uh, Black Hawk holster platform that uh, well I use during uh, my deployment in Iraq and Afghanistan when I was still on active duty. I remove 
the uh, I removed my old holster that was uh, issued to us for the M9 Beretta service uh, pistol, and I am going to uh, replace it with the Omnivore multi fit holster. I'm going to put it like such right here. Look at that, pretty cool, huh? Well, it looks like the handgun fits good, and I am satisfied of how much I paid for it. My Glock should have no problem fitting in this holster as well. Look at that. Some of us doesn't like um, multi holsters and uh, I'm not going to make an argument because it's all about personal preference. If you have uh, multiple firearm in your uh, inventory and you are like me, who gets tired of uh, changing holster every time I go to the range, this holster, well, might be a good option for you. All right, look at that. Well, my friends, this is it for me. Thank you for watching. This is Apollo Kai saying know and follow all the weapons and range safety rules. And let's keep hitting the X-Ring. Simper Fi. Mabuhay po kayong lahat. Until next time. Look at that. Looks good. I like it.